Hey everybody, what's going on? Um, Cosmic Drifter, you know, you always um, get me to respond. Not always, but it's like, you know, when I'm not making videos, it's because of many different reasons. N not good or bad, just for many different reasons, you know. And, and um, you know, um, sometimes I can really just, you know, because of what's happening, sometimes it's just like, it, you know, the last thing that I want to do is try to make a video because I just have so many other things on my mind and going on so I'll do it just I'll just say hello and just keep this very real um, it's the morning it's about 10 30 um, I don't want to get up and close the blinds and the drapes to get rid of the to make the light a little better it's beautiful out the Sun is shining no, you can't. I can't really show you. It's really a beautiful day out. I'm going to be getting out. I've been. Uh, I've already done some work this morning, with for Easy Act. That's um, a very interesting development. Uh, once again, it's like every day I learn a little more. Every day I have to do something. Every day I'm just learning more about, you know, what all the job can entail you know um, and on top of that I'm just you know doing a lot of music actually last night I rehearsed with the strange attractors um, I should leave a link the strange attractors we have a a site up um, is it Bandcamp or is it reverb nation I think where you can hear um, the band um, in Dreama is getting ready to become active again we're having our first rehearsal of the year later today um, just played with Sun Ambulance um, rehearsed with RAF Friday and actually worked on some uh, new material we're, work we're writing you know jamming and writing you know which is is neat it's a neat feeling uh, so that's what's going on musically um, I haven't gotten hardly any records lately some folks say that they're sending me stuff the thing I can share is that I did get my copy of the European version finally see now see that's why I didn't but the myths and realities I have my gray vinyl copy I can you can see that right quick I know the light is bad and I've had a few folks complain about it but there you can see the gray vinyl um, it comes with a CD as well with an extra track on the CD I, I love that about the way that um, Kinetic Records has been doing this. So I'm um, happy to, um, real happy to receive that. On that note, the blue vinyl is all gone, completely sold out by me and in Europe as well. All that's left is the gray. There's only a hundred of these. Who knows how many few of those there are left. There are two blue vinyl copies available for sale in Omaha at Almost Music. And I put a link on my Facebook site. And um, if anyone is wanting to get a hold of that, um, you know, let me know. I'll give, you know, forward you the information. You can order it. Almost Music, you can order it from them and I'll mail it out. Besides that, I am getting ready for, of all things, to participate in a Prince tribute show that's coming up next week. And I've um, uh, been rehearsing for that. I'm not going to do it here because the main thing I've been doing is putting together my tracks. The singing is the going to be the hardest part. You know, one song I might actually, you know, do as a spoken word, just as a, I think it, it can work like that. But anyway, I've been working on that. And then also just, uh, you know, I do, I do play, you know, and I've been trying to get back into practice and, um, was, um, so I'll just play along with an, so this is an old song of mine that I've done a new, um, version of with MIDI. Uh, I originally called this song, Song for Dennis, um, cause it, for some reason it would make me think of my friend Dennis Dowd, who I was hanging out with at the time. He was just a good party and friend still a good friend I don't see him much but I'm just gonna play along with this and um, hope it's not too offensive
Here we go. Here I'm actually playing. I will hear it in a second. I'll be back soon. I hope everyone's well. I'm doing all right. You know, um, I can't lie to you and tell you that everything is great because my psyche feels far beyond what's in this room. And so, last thing I'll say is I'm glad that that policeman resigned in Texas. The swim pool incident was very upsetting. You know, just very upsetting. You know, there's just no justification for the continued. Um, um, way that people, all of us, but my people of color are just not being treated like people. It's like fucking animals get treated better than black people in America right now. It's, it's so sad, you know, and it's like, it's, um, it's, a, it's a way of thinking that really needs to go away, you know. There, 
we're just people. White people aren't better, more privileged, nothing. And it's just this historical legacy of, of, of privilege and having advantages, which is why it won't go away. And the fact that most, there's, you know, this silent, kind of not even realizing that there's a, a silent um, affirmation of the fact that, well, yeah, this is the way it is. And, you know, <laughs> we don't really want it to change. I don't know if that's what's going on, but that's why that's on my mind, you know, and that's what's been on my mind. And sometimes I'll just say to myself, well, since I can't pretend that I'm in a great mood and just want to talk about records, I, I won't make a video because this is what I want to talk about. I'm, you know, hate is not okay. And just looking for excuses to continue to point the finger at one another like it's a us versus them it's just it's time it's just really really it's just discouraging disheartening it's not mature it's not adult it's not civilized and it's just flabbergasting you know the state of the world you know it's just insanely stupid you know things that are going on are just insanely stupid and it's like you know it's kind of like the response of a child or a you know the more you want them to behave, you know, the more they act up. I don't know. See, that's what's on my mind. That's why I haven't been making any videos.